Mike from Eminent Fitness. Just here with another epi, just really talking about the fundies of how to be fucking huge. Hey guys, Mike and Nick here with Eminent Fitness. Just uh, got to Powerhouse. We're gonna film our third full workout. We're gonna film our back day. So stay tuned. So the first exercise that we're gonna do is gonna be a warm up. We're gonna just warm up the rear delts, low weight for high reps. Then we went over to a seated row machine and we did that with low weight as well. Head over to mnnfitness.com and check out some sweet gear that we have. Now the next exercise that we have is our first kind of working set where we're going to start off with a one arm cable pull row and we're going to go right into a lat exercise. exercise will be a lat pull down. When you're performing this exercise, make sure to pull down a little bit beyond your chest. That way you can really engage your lat muscles and feel free to come down slow and up slow to really feel it. barbell rows. First I'm going to go palms facing up, do a few reps like that, then I'm going to turn my hands over and feel free to start with a lower amount of weight if 45s are too heavy just because you don't want any injuries to occur while you're working out. Now that our back is all nice and warmed up is when we'll throw in some deadlifts. So just make sure that you engage your abdominal muscles as well as your lats and your back as you're standing up and keep it nice and fluid and if you have to feel free to drop the weight. I tend to come down slower just to engage more of my back muscles. Cause sometimes you just feel tired, feel weak. Feel weak. You feel like you wanna just give up. But you gotta search within you. Try to find that inner strength and just pull that shit out of you and get that motivation to not give up and not be a quitter. No matter how bad you wanna just fall flat on your face. So I collapse. I'm spilling these raps long as you feel them. To the day that I drop, you'll never say that I'm not killing them. Cause when I am not, then I'ma stop pinning them. And I am not hip hop, and I'm just not. And then 
after our deadlift, we're gonna head over to a hammer strength lat pull down machine and we throw uh, little handles on there so when we pull on it, we can actually get a deeper uh, pull into our lat muscles. Swap to cop, millions of pop listeners You're coming with me, feel it or not You're gonna fear it like I show you the spirit of God lives in us You hear it a lot, lyrics the shock Is it a miracle or am I just product of Then we're gonna head over to the seated row And you can feel free to do this single arm As well as how I do it with both of my arms Till my leg give out, can't shut my mouth Till the smoke clears out, and my high her high I'ma rip this shit, till my bone pull up Till the roof comes on, till the lights go out Till my leg give out, can't shut my mouth then we're gonna head over to the T-bar row, and I'm gonna superset this with seated rows as well to really get that extra tension up in my upper back. This is your moment, and every single minute you spin, trying to hold on to it, cause you may never get it again. So while you're in it, try to get as much shit as you can. And when your run is over, just admit when it's in its end. Cause I'm at the end of my wits with half the shit that gets in. I got a list, here's the order of my list that it's in. It goes Reggie, Jay-Z, Tupac. Then we're gonna do another exercise that targets your lats. You're gonna get a straight bar and you're gonna put it onto the cable machine and you're just gonna pull it down towards your mid section and you're really gonna feel it up in your lats. As soon as the verse starts, I eat it at MC's heart. What is he thinking? I'm not to go against me smart. We're gonna get on a cable roll. And as you pull back, make sure to really engage your back muscles and feel free to tighten up as you're doing it and then slowly let back down. Then we're going to head back over to the T-bar row, but this time we're going to use a wide grip instead of the close grip. Now this is a way to hit your upper back as well as the last exercise. You're just going to get on an incline bench and you're just going to row up and you're going to really concentrate on hitting your upper back muscles. Then one of our final exercises that we're going to be doing is going to be a superset. It's going to be our same exercise we did in one of the first ones where it's an isolated lat pull down. But we're going to superset it with a bent over row as well to really exhaust your lat muscles as well as your back muscles. Hey guys, Mike and Nick. We just finished back day at Powerhouse today. Uh, it was a solid workout. My back is destroyed. Um, but yeah, it was a good one. Yeah, I was able to actually hit a PR on my deadlift today. I mean, to some it may not be that much weight, but you just have to keep grinding and as you keep going, the weight keeps going up and up. And I, mean, I used to work out and plan it a lot, so I wasn't able to really deadlift correctly. So when I actually came over to like a real style gym, it was really weird because on a Smith machine with guided and with the real bar, like there's a lot of room that you can like muscle and it's gonna throw you around, but people kind of like 
just gave me some tips here and there, so I've been able to like strengthen my back up. My deadlift has been going up, so I hope to have it up in the next couple of weeks too. But back day will be great. No other limit is you guys. If you keep pushing, you'll get to your goals. Not only in the gym, not only with anything, but in life too. So keep that in mind. You're only limited to you, right? All right, guys. Catch you later.